I saw a video posted by a woman today and she was just like, I want you to know that not everybody's in a miserable relationship and not every man is out here cheating and not all of us are unhappy. And my instincts are rarely wrong. I was like, this person hate follows me probably. I go to check her page and she's following me. So I block her. Why did I block her? I'm gonna tell you why. Most of us know that there are a very small, minuscule percentage of actually decent men out there. Most of us have common sense, and we know that there are some good relationships out there. A lot of us are very optimistic. Maybe you're still looking for that great man. But let me just say this. No matter how many videos you make trying to remind people that not all men are bad, not everybody is unhappy, one in three women globally has been, will, or is a victim of domestic abuse. So you high-fiving other happily married couples and other couples in relationships does nothing to help those women. And I'm not saying that you can't be thankful for your relationship. I'm happy for you. If, you, if somebody wants a relationship, I want them to be in a happy, healthy one. And there's a time and a place to celebrate happy couples. But being an adult means that, yes, we definitely need to be positive. But there's also a place for negativity. And you also have to be careful that you're not saying that truth is negativity. Me acknowledging the toxicity in the average relationship, because let's be real here and don't call me negative because I'm being honest. The default setting for most relationships is that the woman is not treated well. And I almost want to ask those people and comment and say, what was the point of you saying this? Was it to make yourself feel better? Are you trying to help someone? Because honestly, when I was married to my abusive ex-husband, somebody sitting in front of me and bragging about how happy they were wasn't going to do shit to help me get out of that situation. It wasn't going to do shit to help me not get into another bad situation. I needed someone to be real with me. Give me some signs, things to look out for. Give me some advice. Hell, even our beloved, late, great, iconic Mr. Rogers, may he rest in peace, had episodes of his show where he was honest and he talked about some not so fun aspects of life. But just imagine going up to somebody who has cancer or going to a cancer ward and saying, you know what, not everybody has cancer. Some people are healthy. Time and a place. And why the fuck would you say that? Exactly. Some of y'all are not being positive. You're being a dick and you're not helping. Shut up!